Morning all, welcome to Grandad's allotment. 12th of June today, uh, and it's time to get some of the garlic up. It's uh, it's not gonna do anymore, it's uh, it's dropped, so I'll show you what I'm doing. Right, as you can see, the standard garlic is, is about done. Um, it's not gonna do anymore, but I need the beds, to be honest, so. Um, the elephant garlic still doing all right. They've got the scapes on. I'll probably take them off uh, today. But I'm going to get these these bits of garlic up in these couple of beds here, uh, just so I can clear the beds because I've got a few pumpkins and stuff I need to get in. Right, that's it a bit. Right, let's see what we've got. I'm not holding out any hopes for it. Nout. Nout. It's been rubbish this garlic this year out right it's all coming out in the bin right i've cleared out the garlic so i'm just going to do a bit uh, i'm going to put a couple of pumpkins in there uh, and then i'm going to put one over here as well uh, a couple of butternut squash so i've just cleared the bits of garlic out that i had here and the little onions there's a couple there that's not doing too bad there a couple of um turn it so I'll, I'll leave them for a minute so let's take a bit of a hole put a bit of my six x in the bottom and um, what have we got here jack o' lanterns what do I put butternut squash I'm going to put butternut squash in there because they are clean squash tahiti melon fairly decent roots on them right, so we'll get another one in there and hopefully these will climb a bit more than six x Already. Right. So it's two there. Let's find where else I can put them. Probably go here. Yeah. They were, they were both garlic as well from proper sets, but I'm going to stick to mash up both garlic. So six x. Hopefully we can get these to clean. Yeah, there's purple top one on turnips, they've just gone straight to seed, so we'll replace them. Get some butter nut squash again. Last one. Slugs get them. Right, I'm gonna find a space for for these. So I've got pumpkins, small sugar. So I might put them on the other side to climb up. Uh, what else have we got? That's a marrow. So I'll put them in the beds over there, and then I've got. Some more squash, jack o' lantern, more butternuts, more 
and that's right i'll find some space for them hi right so i've planted up my my squashes in my maras so i'm just going to water them in these are the maras going to get a good water in i put the super soil on on this before i when i cleared it out and weeded it these are just getting a good water three maras in here it's probably too much but we'll see uh, there's a jack o pumping in there. Oh, yeah. I've just dotted them all over, to be honest. This is I wouldn't normally grow. And the strawberries. Got one in each. These are just jack o lantern pumping, so just little ones. The strawberries will be dying off soon, so. Hopefully there'll be something growing in that bed, but I don't want to take the strawberries out. And then I've just got some round the, um, the bean latch, the butternut squash, so they'll climb. A couple there to climb. And I've just got half a dozen around the bottom here again I'm watering it with the six sets this has been treated with the super soil as well so just pour in here Hopefully the slopes will not get them. Right, that's it for the day. Right, that's it for today. Just a quick short one, just to uh, see what the garlic's like. No good, rubbish, I'm not doing that again. So that was bought garlic from, from seeds. Well, not from seeds, from, but from cloves, um, seed cloves. Um, and no more rubbish so i'm going to stick to doing my my normal shop bought garlic um and just the elephant garlic in fact i might just do the elephant garlic next year because i get a better return from that uh, i've popped in my, some more of my squashes so i've done butternut squash from um, mini jack-o-lanterns and a couple of marrows i've still got um some squash to do some snake gourds i'll show you them so i've got a tray of snake gourds to do uh, that's them. Um, so I'll, but I'll do them next week because I need a, another couple of beds free and I need to make some sort of framework for them. Right, that's it definitely this time. And we'll catch us on the next one. Thanks for liking and subscribing. See you later.